What's up guys? We decided to take an impromptu trip to the Dallas Zoo because we haven't been to the zoo in years. I haven't been to this zoo since I was like a little kid. I think I last came on a field trip and she hasn't been in like two years or something like that. But we're here. We're only here for a few hours. We came kind of late. The zoo closes at five. But we're gonna make the best of it. I fucking love the zoo. My dream job was always to be a zookeeper. Fun fact. But. Our goal today is to take a monkey home. <laughs> <laughs> How do you measure up to a penguin? Well, no, where do I? Look at it. Look at the You're like twice the height. Am I a penguin? Like, am I a penguin enough? <laughs> it's on their face. If you guys have been watching, has Regis blinked at all? No, he's no eyelids. They don't have eyelids. It's Freezing outside, a little bit high on the feeling. Can't see to focus. In the corner of my best friend's sofa, you were getting by some rum and cola. Wasn't brave enough yet just to talk to you. Not a smooth talker, under pressure. Sweaty palms ain't making it much better. Something scratch <laughs> all right we're in some like bird exhibit where the birds are all around us trying not to get pooped on even though they're right above us right there what animal are you most looking forward to looking that's an interesting question I don't know <laughs> besides trying to take home a monkey you can't take home a monkey so why not next how about a dinosaur I want to see some velociraptors clever girl I'm gonna risk it all. I'm gonna jump in there with the elephants. And just okay. swim with them. And get crushed and get banned crushed. from the zoo forever. <laughs> To get your attention, you make me nervous. In the corner of my best friend's sofa, you were getting by some rum and cola. Wasn't brave enough yet just to talk to you. We love you though. I wanted to come over here. I don't think it's gonna listen, dude. Oh. Come here, you dog. No? <laughs> no I don't think I've ever seen uh, canned water before. I've seen boxed water, bottled water, now canned water. I guess. Save the, save the planet. Delicious. I'm not gonna lie, I really hate bugs. So being here is giving me like the creepy crawlies. Especially seeing this black widow right here. Black widow in there. This is what I'm talking about, I hate bugs. And they actually have a hissing cockroach exhibit. These things are massive, look at this.
Rafiki. Found Rafiki. Most colorful ass I've ever seen. Oh, my ass to be colorful. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna become the latest trend. People are gonna start colorful rainbow asses. tattooing their asses like baboons. Hey, you never know. Society's crazy. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> That's racist. Whether we're at the fair or anywhere, we are notoriously bad at reading maps. Yeah. I don't know what it is. I think Google has spoiled us with Google Maps, but we, we suck at reading maps. Oh, look, it's over here in this corner. Right. So, it's right where the cheetah was. We were over there. Is that where that? Yeah, look. That's where we're trying to get to. Right. We have to go. We were just there. I guess we missed it. What is it? The. What is it called? Herpetarium reptiles and amphibians. Alright, that's where we're going. What the fuck happened? Something is missing here. <laughs> Where's the rest of his body? It's just make me move. Um, it doesn't work. No. No. Fail. Nope. I blame the storm. It's Kobe Bryant. That is the most terrifying animal of all time. Harpy eagles are creepy as shit. Look at the way it's staring at you. I think I'd rather run into a tiger than a harpy eagle. Fuck that. We've been here for what, roughly three hours? Yeah, I thought we were gonna be too late. We weren't gonna get to do much, but I feel like three hours was enough. We got to see everything, walk around. Babe's pretty tired. She's pooped. Tired. Hey. I think now we're probably gonna leave and find somewhere to eat because we both haven't eaten all day. So, stomach's rumbling, getting dizzy. Let's go. Hey, come back to me. <laughs> <laughs> we're both hangry. Hangry as fuck. Yeah, I'm very the, the, the dilemma is always finding a place to eat. There's like 10,000 places to eat in Dallas, but of course, it's hard to decide. Isn't it, babe? Yes, babe. You never can decide, ever. So we're basically walking around Deep Ellum trying to decide where to eat because we're fading fast. I'm getting very hangry. Getting hangry. Better. All right, we're leaving. Food acquired, it was me. She's not hangry anymore, but she's tired. Can't even see her. She's that tired. There you go. Get, get, get in there. All right. I think that's it for our Deep Ellum adventure and our adventure all day. We're kind of tired. Don't feel like walking around anymore in Deep Ellum, but yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog here. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. Leave a comment. I love reading comments and replying to them. And see you guys on the next vlog. Peace. Bonus content. Yeah. Thought we ended the vlog. A little bonus for you guys. Uh, we just went to GameStop and they bought this mystery Funko box for $10. $30 value for $10. It says there's, what, five things? Five pieces within it. 
she she decided to give it a try, so I'm gonna unbox it. All right, I need a knife. No. This or is her part of the vlog. Or your nails. Either or we're up. Guess what, guys? A bunch of nothing. Nothing. They gave me a box full of nothing. All right. Just kidding. <laughs> Pay ten dollars for the box. Just the box itself. Well. It contains a lot of cool Funko stuff though. Is there an actual pop in it? Yes, it's all the way to the bottom. Alright, you ready? Yeah. So we got a cool Star Wars pen. That's cool. We got a little Chewbacca. Chewy over here. It's a cool pen. I like it. Yeah. We also got this cool little cute weeby from DuckTales. We have a pin size Heroes Disney. Da -da -da. But who doesn't love Disney? I'm hoping, let's see, what's back here? Ooh, Eve would be nice to get. Open it. It's like a mystery within a mystery. <gasps> oh, I got Wally though. That's so cute. Mira, it's so adorable. That is cute as well. We got another mystery one, and it's a Kingdom Hearts one. I'm not really a big fan of Kingdom Hearts, but uh, you know, here we go. Yeah. Let's see. It's like a mystery within a mystery within a yeah, mystery. Yeah, it's like a box in a box in a box. What's you know? in the box? What's in the fucking box? Oh, we got the kid. What's his name? Oh, Sora. Nice. Get the main character. Worth it. Meh. No. Is that the last thing? Yes, this is the last item in our box. It's getting broken. And I'll probably have to do this too, actually. There you go. What'd you get? Ta -ta. Oh, the Monsters Inc. version of Sora mm -hmm. from Kingdom Hearts. Not bad. I like this box. Yeah. Pretty cool. I'd it's say for $10. Cool yeah. Let's say for ten dollars, that's a hell of a deal because this is usually eight bucks on yeah. its own. The, the this is probably like six bucks. Yeah. The pop itself is like fourteen dollars. The stupid pen is like probably three to four bucks. Yeah. And then you know you got your little tiny character. That's another like eight dollars. So come on. Yeah. So worth it. Worth it. Ten dollars well spent. There's that's it for the bonus content. All right. Now the vlog's ending. All right. Peace. Oh yeah. Thank you. So adorable.